Happy Monday. Time now for that most accurate forecast. I'm meteorologist Iris Amrosio. We are coming off of another record-setting weekend where every day those temperatures set a new record high for the date. Even though temperatures trended down, we reached a high of 103 yesterday, 104 on Saturday. Both of those record-setting days, both of those, those unseasonably hot conditions for this time of year. We've got potentially one more record-setting day on our hands, and then some relief is coming our way. By the way, our overnight low yesterday also set a new record, dipping down to 75 degrees. But even that is unseasonably warm for this time of year and a record setting low, warm low for yesterday's date. Those overnight lows have been above normal too, but also some relief coming when it comes to those overnight low temperatures too. We've got one more day where we could set a record. The record stands at 100 degrees today. I'm forecasting a high of 101. The average, by the way, is 90. So we're still talking temperatures that are about 10 degrees above normal, and we could set a new record this afternoon. By the way, that record was set on multiple occasions on this date back in 2010 and 2015 and in 2020. It seems like every five years, right? And this year, of course, not quite five years, but again, potentially setting a new record high for today's date. 101 for a high this afternoon. Then temperatures start to come down into the upper 90s Tuesday and Wednesday, still above normal, a little closer to average by Thursday. Then look what happens Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Yeah, you're seeing that right. High temperatures fall into the low 80s by Saturday. We may even struggle to get out of the 70s, believe it or not, as we track a storm system. Now, this is still about five plus days out, so we'll see how things play out. But I can tell you that high pressure shifting off to the east. We've got a storm system that's going to bring a slight chance for showers to northern Arizona today and tomorrow as it pushes through northern Arizona. It'll be dry in the valley, but that's going to drop those temperatures out of the hundreds. And then towards the end of the week, we've got another stronger storm system that will dive further to the south and that one may have more moisture to work with bringing a better chance for showers our way especially to the higher terrain of eastern Arizona but also that huge drop in temperatures that could put those temperatures down into the 80s by the weekend that high today 101 so hold on to that hope right get us through one more triple digit day temperatures in the 70s to 80s across northern Arizona tomorrow we're into the upper 90s and then by Wednesday still in the upper 90s but those temperatures come down into the low 90s Thursday it gets breezy with a 40 percent chance of showers Friday, rain chances into the weekend and cooler too.